Good morning, welcome to your 815 daily operations weather briefing. Looking at our current surface analysis, you can see that we do have this boundary off to our north, currently a stationary boundary. It's going to be dipping uh, into our region over the next 24 hours, bringing us a slight chance of seeing a shower or so within the next 24 hours, uh, and then increasing chances of rain and thunderstorms as we move into Wednesday evening and Thursday morning. Looking at our current weather, we have a few clouds at 8,000 feet and a broken deck of cirrus clouds at 25,000 feet. Wind is currently coming out of the west at 6 knots. Temperature is 71 degrees and relative humidity is 68%. As we look at our visible satellite imagery, you can see a substantial amount of cirrus clouds moving uh, into our area from the north. And you can see uh, these are our lower level clouds and they're going to be slowly building into our region as we move throughout the day today. So uh, going to be seeing mainly mostly cloudy conditions uh, until we reach potentially overcast conditions as we move later into the evening and into tomorrow morning. And as we look at our reflectivity for today, uh, starting out this morning, as you can see not much of a chance of us uh, seeing any showers, uh, but as we move into the later portions of the day into this evening, you can see around 7 p.m. or so, uh, we'll be seeing a slight chance of a brief shower in our area. As we continue to move throughout uh, the evening and tomorrow morning, just going to be a slight chance of seeing any other uh, remnant shower from the system uh, in our area early in the morning on Wednesday, but other than that, may, I'll mainly try 24 hours. As we look at our 24-hour weather risk chart today, uh, you can see mostly cloudy conditions throughout most of the day time today. As we move into the evening and early morning hours of Wednesday, going to be seeing more overcast conditions. Our temperatures right now starting out at 71 degrees. Going to be seeing a high today around 80 and a low tonight around 68. And our winds today starting out westerly, going to be shifting between westerly and southwesterly throughout uh, much of the next few hours. And as we move uh, into the overnight hours, becoming a bit more southerly and floating between uh, south southeasterly and south southwesterly as we move. Further into Wednesday morning, shifting to be a bit more southwesterly at 8 to 13 knots, gusting up to about 19 knots. And as I mentioned before, this brief chance of seeing uh, a very brief shower uh, sometime around 7 or 8 p.m. most likely tonight. And then a very slight chance of seeing uh, some sort of shower in the morning hours of tomorrow. And as we look at the next seven days, going to be seeing some active weather in our region starting on Wednesday. Wednesday is going to be mostly cloudy to overcast, a slight chance of a shower or thunderstorm, especially late in the day on Wednesday, uh, slightly breezy with a high of 77. As we move into Wednesday night, it's going to be uh, cloudy conditions with a good chance of low clouds, showers, and thunderstorms, slightly breezy as well with a low of 67. And then Thursday, a slight chance of a lingering shower or thunderstorm early, then mostly cloudy with a high of 77. That's going to conclude our 815 daily operations weather briefing. We'll see you again at 10 a.m. I hope you guys have a great day.